everybody is doing particularly well today. As you can see on my necklace, my name is Kathy. So I have one question for you guys. How do you pronounce my last name? Let me give you a hint. It is the opposite of lose. So the opposite of lose is win, right? So yeah, that's how you pronounce my last name. I like to think of us as winners. And so to move on, uh, you can call me Miss Kathy or Miss H. Or Miss Wynn would be okay too. All three of those sound pretty cool. Um, I'm here today as a psych tech student from San Bernardino Valley College. Um, me, as well as my other fellow classmates, are here to help you uh, feel confident in learning, have fun. And, and it's always so great to learn something on the daily to keep your brain working and your brain always winning. And so I'm a nail tech. I know I don't have anything on my nails right now, but that's basically how I've been helping others feel better about themselves, feel confident about themselves, and I'm all for it. Um, I paint nails, I paint toenails, I do whatever you want, as long as it's in doing nails. So I wanted to show you some pictures of what I've done over the years. I really like doing designs for Halloween, Christmas, any kind of holiday, you name it. So I'm just going to show you those right now. <laughs> Badminton. So what that is, is that it's like tennis, but instead of a bigger racket, you got a smaller racket. And you have a birdie that you can hit around and have fun with. I also used to volunteer at a Buddhist Youth Association temple across from Arroyo Valley High School in San Bernardino. Um, what we did there was every Sunday we would learn about leadership. We would also learn about more about our culture and Buddhism. We also learned how to read, uh, read, write, and speak more Vietnamese. I also had the opportunity to teach some little ones to speak Vietnamese as well. And so to see them grow and learn each Sunday, it was, it was, it was really great to see them grow. And what I really liked the most was traditional dancing. So every year we would hold a Chinese Vietnamese New Year or an anniversary just to showcase our culture and our dances to actually you know embrace it so I'm gonna show you a few clips that I've done in the past here we go As much as I did, I look forward to meeting everyone and getting to know everyone to start this new journey of learning and having fun. So you guys have a great day now, okay? Bye! And that's all, folks.